The number of air travelers are increasing year on year and the airspace are getting more crowded. Atlanta Hartsfield Jackson Airport is the world's busiest airport and around 140 million travelers use this airport. And the airport handled 940,000 aircraft on year of 2017. For all the departures and landings, the coordination between pilot and each aircraft and ATC is important to get the clearance and, as well as providing significant information about the situations in the airport. Controller have to provide all these significant information repeatedly for all aircrafts they handle, and which will increase the controller workload and as well as the frequency congestion. Automatic Terminal Information Service or ATIS is designed to overcome this problem. Two types of ATIS broadcasts are available. First type is Voice ATIS. Voice ATIS is a continuous broadcast of recorded aeronautical information in the airports. ATIS broadcasts contain essential information, such as current weather information, active runways, available approaches, and other information required by the pilots, such as important notams. Each airport chart has its dedicated frequency for ATIS broadcasts. Pilot needs to tune to the respective frequency to listen to an available ATIS broadcast before contacting ADC, which reduces the controller's workload and relieves frequency congestion. ATIS messages will be updated during specific intervals and as well as any change in information. Every time during the update the ATIS identification letter will be changed. When contacting the local control unit, pilots indicate their information of the ATIS identification letter which they received. This helps the ATC controller verify that the pilot has all current information. Let's listen to the sample ATIS message which is broadcasted in Skipple Airport. This is Skipple arrival information, Kilo, main landing runway 18 right. Transition level 5, 0, 2, 0, 0 degrees, 1, 1 knots. Visibility 1, 0 kilometers. View 1,300 feet, scattered 1,800 feet, broken 2,200 feet. Temperature 1, 5, dew point 1, 3, QNH, 9, 9, 5, hectopascal, no significant change, contact approach and arrival call sign only, end of information, kilo. Second type is data link ATIS also called as DATIS. DATIS is a text-based, digitally transmitted version of the ATIS audio broadcast. It is accessed via data link service such as the ACARS and displayed on an electronic display in the aircraft. DATIS is incorporated on the aircraft as part of its electronic system, such as an EFB or an FMS. Pilot can tune to DATIS frequency in the airport to connect and receive the latest ATIS messages and verify them. Data link services are effectively used to address the air traffic controllers and pilot communication problems. ATIS is the one of the best way to achieve.